We are at Missouri's largest firework tent and we're gonna be doing some shopping today. The tent just opened up, so we're getting in here early. It's open every day through July 5th. Gonna be buying all sorts of random stuff today. We're gonna get some small items, some fountains, some tuna gram cakes, Roman candles, and more. Let's grab some fountains. These are the Zen Garden Fountains from Sky Bacon. Price $10.99 for a pack. I'm gonna flip around here. I wanna grab some parachutes. I feel like I don't light enough parachutes and I saw some different varieties over here. So we have a parachute with flag from Bright Star. It looks like another one also from Bright Star. And then we also have, you know, color changing flare parachutes from Winda. A lot of different options, single parachutes and the like. I think we're gonna go with the color changing flare pack. So six pieces here. Pricing is $21.99 for six pieces. Someone said recently, Joel, you should buy more rockets. So that's exactly what we're gonna to do today. Let's grab some of these $5 parachute rockets. We're gonna get some of the Skybolt rockets from Brothers as well. And those are $23.99. Everything on the center table here is from Realtree Fireworks, and I wanted to point out, I actually got a bunch of these because they have turbillions in them, so I'm gonna be using some of those in my fire, firework show this year. But I wanted to grab some of these Roman candles. They're $12.99 for a pack of four. I feel like we should grab some firecrackers. Got a few different options here. Thinking just these $2 packs of the M200 Salutes from Sky Bacon. We got a bunch more Roman candles here on this table. Excuse me. And we're gonna grab a pack of these taco candles. 20 bucks for four. Check these things out. Jurassic Jungle. I feel like if I got these, my daughter would just want to keep it as a pet. <laughs> I see something over there I want to get. I want to look at those. So this outside wall here is all smaller novelty things and I feel like this is overlooked a lot. So we have these buzz bangs for four dollars for a pack of three of them and these are a ton of fun for the price. Jumbo crackling balls from Sky Bacon, $4.49 for three. These are another item that are really fun to play with and are inexpensive. Okay these are what I wanted to check out. These are smoking skeeters and these are four helicopters and what's really cool about them is when they spin on the ground they smoke before leaving the ground. So which means it's a great daytime item, small and expensive, a lot of fun or you could also light them during the night. So in the middle of the store like this table and these tables are all tuna ram cakes. We're going to come back to those in a second. There's another table of tuna ram cakes here. Around the outside we have some different assortment items here. Moving on to the Noabs. We'll take a look at those. I'm not planning on buying any, any of the Noabs today. I do have a case of these two-inch titanium willows from Taco that I'm using in my 4th of July show this year. So something like this, the Nishiki Ghost Ring from Taco, this is going to be the biggest, best effect you can buy in a consumer market. However, it's going to cost you, right? So a lot of times if you're on a budget, Avoid these type of things and focus on smaller items such as tuna ram cakes, which is what I'm going to do next. You know what? Can't go wrong with some smoke. This pack of smoke balls, $12.99. did a video on these guys, Angry Cowboy, where I had four of them. That was a really good tuna ram cake. And one of the funny things is the ones I had were actually smaller. So this one is actually a bigger better 200 gram cake version. So check these out, Fish Frenzy. I actually had some of these in my fireworks show last year. 549, it's just basically nine small flying fish effects. Pretty in Pink from Shogun. I actually used a bunch of those in my daughter's gender reveal. So it's a really good 200 gram cake, $15 for one piece. And here's some smoke items if you wanna do more daytime fireworks from Winda. Smoke Dragon, $25.
more 200 gram cakes over here. 99 red balloons from Sky Bacon, 17.99. The effects seem pretty solid. So this will be an item that I'll demo in a future video. Dragon Duel from Winda. This graphic caught my eye. It's a really awesome looking graphic. But then I was looking at the effects and it looks like it's got some scrambling style comments in the brace, which I thought was really interesting. 16 shots, I'm gonna grab one for $19.99. So a couple of these items are 350 grams. And you'll see some solid pricing on some of them. For example, Summer Sizzle Sky Bacon 350 gram cake, $29. And what I mean by that is, is if you were to try to get a 500 gram cake, if we jump over here to Light Brigade, it's $63. So I could get two of the Summer Sizzles for the same price, actually cheaper price than I could the Light Brigade. Sakamon, 35 bucks. And Summer Sizzle, $29. So everything in this section here are 5 gram cakes, and then we have some zipper cakes over there and shells around the back wall. Let's take a look at some of the 500 gram cakes. All right, take me to your leader, Gerandola, and you'll see this design here. The arm has been changed so they do not break as easily. Someone pointed out in the video that I did where I was repairing the Gerandola that that's already been made, and I see it in store, so that's awesome. Oh, and also, for retail price for that Gerandola, $95. So when you're looking at the price of a lot of 500 gram cakes, you'll see that they can be quite expensive, which is why a lot of times I can get several 200 gram cakes for the same price as a 500 gram cake, and why I think a lot of times that's the better deal. Now, a lot of times places like this will have different deals. So I love it loud, 33 shot 500 gram cake. It's smaller in size, but 33 shots, buy one, get one for $9, so it'd be $45 each. So that wouldn't be a terrible deal to grab that. Okay, so you'll see some of their Pro-Line items out on the shelves, and that's because they're not professional use only, they're just solid effect cakes. So for example, 9-Shot Nishiki Kimuro, or the 49-Shot Lemon and Purple Go-Getters, 25 seconds. Silver and Gold from Taco. You'll see this is 119 buy one get one. I'm specifically pointing this out because I got a case of these this year, and I'm actually not using them in my 4th July show, so you'll see those in a future video. Also, check this guy out. So this Shogun UFO Encounter, cake around the outside and there's a gerandola in the middle and I believe it's a two-stage gerandola. So these are all zippers. Pandemonium, I just lit this one recently from Winda. $200 for that zipper. Well, that's not a zipper. Look at that giant jellyfish effect from Taco. Love the graphic on this cake. Love the effect as well. That one's 160. Everything along this back wall are the shells. So I'm gonna get some ball shells here. I wanna get some of these happy face shells, $35 for a set of six, I think, from Sky Bacon. Look at those smiley faces. All right, so we dumped our card off and we're gonna do another round. So I'm gonna get this Silent Night Fountain because apparently it's quiet effect, 15 bucks. And then I saw another fountain down here I wanted to grab. Yeah. UFO, it looks like it's a spinning type fountain. The light will change here. And that is $22. So you see the Spinner of Fortunes. This is actually a pack of four. They are $39 a piece. I actually have seven of these in my show this year that instead of putting them flat, I'm mounting them on towers. <laughs> so that's gonna be freaking cool. Well, we're gonna grab some of these large strobes, a four pack from Superior for $7. Sorry, a four pack from Supreme for $7. Okay these shark fountains with stickers so you can make faces and stuff on them. $31. And the only reason I'm going to get this is because I know my daughter is going to love watching these things go off. I decided I'm going to really like these things because of the fact they're daytime items and also uh, helicopters. $7. I'm going to get another pack. You know what? We might as well get a pack of quick fuse while we're here. $20. bucks. can never have too much quick fuse. 
Okay, I'm back at the shells. I feel like this is where I should spend the rest of the money. Uh, the question is what? So you'll see the smoke and mirrors here. Buy one, get one for 80 bucks for six pack. That's some of the better pricing shells here. There's also the Hellcat cans that go um, for 75. The Ringmaster six inch shells, those are gonna be awesome shells. The double and triple brake shells are always a good time. So I could get, for example, one of each of these. Those would be really cool. So everything here that I'm getting is going to be used in future videos. So I'm trying to think of like some stuff to mix and match that you guys might want to see. So let's take a look at some of the shells again. And you'll see here the Shogun 24 turbocharged shells for 109. That's actually one of the better priced per shell cost. I haven't had those shells, so I can't say how they compare against like the plutonium shells or whatever. It also only comes with two tubes and you notice the packaging is way really smaller than some of the other guys. I think I'm going to risk it. We're going to go for it. All right, guys, here's the total haul. This was $480 before tax or $507 after tax. And a couple things I wanted to note here. Number one, if you're getting to the point where you're spending $500 or more on fireworks, I highly recommend moving over to wholesale. I'm going to have a video coming out in a couple days on that process, and you can kind of see the price difference between retail and wholesale. A couple items I want to highlight here. I think things like buzz bangs are really good bang for your buck items because you get three of them for $4. Same with the crackling balls, three for $4.50. And these parachute rockets, six for $4.50 five dollars so if you're on a budget those are the type of items i would personally look at some things that i probably could have avoided the shark novelty the only reason i got that is because my daughter's gonna love seeing those lit but those were thirty dollars so if i would have skipped that i could have easily gotten another dragon duel plus some more small items i also picked up some quick fuse mostly because of how rare that's been recently they're twenty dollars a roll if i would have skipped the quick fuse and the sharks i could have picked up a 500 gram cake for example Something else I want to mention is the turbocharged shells. Those are actually inch and a half canister shells. I did not realize that in the store. However, that is still the best bang for my buck as far as shells go. So if you're on a budget, consider those type of items as well. I think I'm personally most excited about the Dragon Duel Tuna Ram Cake because of the effects it noted. And I really enjoy things like this. Smoke Tails of Helicopters. I personally have a lot of fun with. So look for a lot of these items in future videos. I'll probably do multiple videos with this stuff. For example, all the small stuff might be one video. Some of the cakes in another one. The shells I'll probably throw up in my fourth july or something like that in the finale anyways let me know if you guys have a favorite item here in the comments below and we'll see you in the next video yeah,